Hi everybody. I would like to explain the immediate risk to Israel national security in two minutes. I worked with Benjamin Netanyahu for many years as his head of security. I have thousands of hours with him and I have great respect to the man that led the fight against Iran and to the man that led us into the Abraham Accords. This is not the same Netanyahu. In the recent weeks, the head of the IDF, the head of the Mossad, and the head of the Shabak all said the same thing. This is not the same man we know. Two days ago, Nadav Gaman, my former boss, and the head of the Shabak said, we are all serving our nation, but we will not serve the king. In Israel, all our special units, in all of those organizations, are all dependent on volunteers. And our volunteers already announced that if this coup will continue, they will start serving. Benjamin Netanyahu had to fly to Italy a couple of days ago. It took the Israeli army five days to find two pilots that will be willing to fly our prime minister. Today, our army special unit, Moon, special operation, announced that starting today, they will not serve in the Israeli army. This is an immediate and critical risk to Israel. You have to understand, it's not left against right, it's not men and women, it's not religious or secular. We are all there. We cannot serve our country unless our country is a democracy that comply with the international law. Benjamin Netanyahu is currently led by extremists that have no idea how to run a country in the Middle East. And therefore, he allows them to drive us into chaos. And the first chaos is in our security services. Benjamin Netanyahu is not the same man that you and me know anymore. Please help us save the Israeli democracy.